Let us never tolerate outrageous conspiracy theories. The way we police in the, UK, in the UK, the way we police is by consent. They police with consent. So what have I learned in the last year and a half? I've learned about status, standing, jurisdiction. Uh, you know, it's funny, we didn't, I didn't know that I could correct my status, you know, until about a year and a half ago. Isn't that, isn't that interesting? I mean, did you know you could correct your status? You could change your status and then that gives you different privileges or rights, right? What is your status? Your status is, is that what you claim to be, right? My status is that of a living man. I am a creation of nature and nature's God. I am not a creation of a government or some sort of de facto corporation. I'm a creation of nature, I'm a creation of God, and therefore I stand under him only. I answer to him and his natural laws, not to man-made laws. So status, standing, jurisdiction. What is jurisdiction? Juris is type of law. Diction is the words we use. So the diction that you use determines which juris you stand under. And this is something that the policy enforcers need to be taught so that when they pull people over and they say, I'm traveling, they should say, oh, okay, you're not operating in commerce. Have a nice day, sir. But instead, they've been trained by bar attorneys which took us over with legalese and equivocation, syllogism, spelling, the manipulation of words. We think we're saying one thing, you know, we think we're saying, they ask us, hey, are you this person? And we're in court and we think, well, yeah, that's me. Looks like my name. It's all caps, but what does that matter, right? Now, well, you're telling them that you're the vessel. You're the signatory agent for that vessel and you are going to be held as surety until the bond can be settled because you are the person, the purser, the, the officer that pays all the debts of the vessel. And now we have a bunch of bar attorneys, a bunch of agents of the crown that rule everything. Nothing gets passed or done without an attorney say so an actor to a turn. He acts out something enough to convince the jury to uh, steal from one person and give it to another. Convinces the jury of a story, an actor to a turn. And whatever, in, in these Roman courts, the, the jury, right, I always mix these up, trial by jury or a jury trial, the judge gets to decide at the end. And the jury really has no no impact, right? We don't know better. That's, it's jur trial by jury and a jury trial. See, it's so confusing, you know, right? And they do it on purpose. Same way that they, oh, I'm gonna, we're gonna call the new corporation United States. And they, yeah, it's perfect, you know? It'll sound just the same. People won't be the wiser. Let's name the, the, the bank, the private bank that loans the, the, the people their money and charges them interest, the Federal Reserve. And then they'll think it's federal and they'll think it has a reserve. Ha ha ha. <laughs> oh man. The codes were written for persons, not living men. And that's how the elite scoot around them, right? You go in there, it's a big deal. They want, they want to force, uh, you to play their games but when their judges their friends go in there they probably uh they probably pass them through oh you were traveling yes of course you were traveling you have a right to travel judge but you citizen what are you, traveling right to travel no such thing never heard of it let me access your trust real quick and we'll get you out of here they made us all slaves under the social security and the birth certificate tricked our parents into signing us over and, and you know, I guess it all comes down to they needed money to create the corporation and the crown corp that they were borrowing money from said, yeah, we'll loan you the money, but you guys are broke. What are you going to give us? And they said, we'll give you the people. 
We'll give you the people that are gonna be in this new corporation and their taxes and their income, all right? We'll trick them, we'll make them think they're all city's ends, employees of the corporation, and then we'll tax them and they won't know any better because we'll trick them with diction and long ass forms that no one wants to read. <sighs> More high level thinking, you know guys, I see a lot of division in the community of people trying to learn to be free again. But let's keep in mind that, you know, we were all brainwashed a long time ago, growing up in this beast system, this, the lie of scarcity everywhere. We know they've had free energy, they've had the cures and they kept it all. So we've all been traumatized. We've all been forced to live in this matrix. And I just ask you to be patient. And you know, we all have different processes and different comprehensions of things as we move forward, but we all have a lot more in common than we do apart. Remember who the enemy is. Trapped your mind, kept, kept the knowledge and the light for themselves, right? They see themselves as the illuminated ones. They're standing on the white squares and we're standing on the black squares. That's how they wanna keep it. And that's a big hurdle for people, right? You're telling me that there's a big class of people that think of me as a slave and they hate me and they're basically evil. You know, I got a lot of people in my life that wanna see everything as rainbows and butterflies. There's nothing bad in the world, there's no evil. And that's a big hurdle for people to overcome because I don't know, look around, they're putting masks on children. So people need to wake up, you know? They infiltrated, I mean, God, dude. This deep state has infiltrated countries across the world using color revolutions, blackmail, right? Blackmail to control. That's why nothing ever gets done because all of our politicians are controlled. Congress, controlled. We've been in a state of war my entire life unreal money doesn't exist right fiat currency just all made up bankers can just make money loan it to you charge you interest and they're not even loaning you their money it's your money <laughs> and then they charge you interest on it and then if you can't pay they take your house and then people say there's no such thing as evil my god wake up wake up so anyway keep that in mind when you're getting mad at people in the chats or online focus on what you have in common and not the process issues right in the end of this we should all have so much there's no it's scarcity is a lie folks there was never any scarcity we have free energy. You don't think there's technology out there to solve every problem? All the environmental problems? Feed everyone? For some reason, it's impossible. Well, it's because there's a class of people that have been controlling this world. I don't vote. Why would I vote for the president of McDonald's? Right? The United States Corporation has no jurisdiction over me. Y'all need to wake up to that fact. You know, you get pulled over on the freeway, that's just a corporation pulling you over. It's not real government. How does that make you feel? All the tickets you've ever paid, that's just some employee of McDonald's pulling you over. <laughs> Giving the fear of God into you, tons of anxiety, and calling it for public safety. It's all about tacit agreement for these bricks. It's like the same thing with meets and bounds and land. They call it property instead of land, and they give it to you in lot numbers instead of meets and bounds. And then that's how they trick you. And then they tax you because they're, they're like, look, it's property. And you're like, brr, 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 what's the difference? A warranty deed is not a true title and it will never be a true title. What you want is a land patent and a lodial title, superior title. So, if you own property, 
and you have a warranty deed and you're listed as the tenant in common, tenants in common, tenant in common, the state stole your land and gave you property and then taxed you for it. You don't have the mineral rights, right? You don't own that at all. You're just using it. They gave you a, a privilege to do business in DC to make and incur a loss. So y'all better start studying this. They did the same thing with your car and they did the same thing with your kids. All right, guys, I'll keep this relatively short and um, have a great day. I'll see you on the chats. Be well. If you don't like what we tell you to believe in, we'll kill you.